Okay, so we are gonna start with a timely topic, I think. Should you share your location with your partner? Like, I'm talking tech here, okay? No. That's a big no. Okay, so we're talking about those tracking features on your phone, because according to a USA Today article, this issue, it actually comes up a lot. Like, 80 to 90% of people in their teens 20s and 30s are having these discussions, like, do I share where I am with you? Okay, the idea of your partner, Jamie, knowing where you are at all times because they can just boop, oh, there's Jamie. Is that cool with you? No, this reminds me of like, there are helicopter parents and there are helicopter partners. Yeah. You do not need to know where I am all the time if you trust me. And so oh, there's a question there, why there. do you need to know where I am? And let's say I want to plan you a birthday party and I don't want you to know. I don't want you knowing where I'm going to do that. So yeah. there are real reasons to yeah. not share your location. Also, I mean, you're right, because I could see somebody who maybe has trust issues being like, I want to know, I want to keep tracks. First of all, you probably need to go to therapy to unpack this, because you're either going to trust <laughs> or not. But secondly, even if you see, okay, so today I saw that you checked in at such and such a cafe, what were you doing there? They can just lie. Like, like it's not like either you trust them or you don't, you know what I mean? Or show up. Yeah, or, I mean, <laughs> show is that our show up? <laughs> I mean, there's one thing to be sitting in your office going, oh, there's Jamie, and there's another thing to be like, I'm gonna go see Jamie. And what's Jamie doing at that cafe? Oh, that's so creepy. I know, that I know. So, to me, it's a stalker. Like, yeah. stalker vibes entirely. I can see how this would go into that I can kind see of that, too. I can see that in certain relationships, in certain situations. I've been married 20 years, and I can say... <laughs> <laughs> I can say that, thank you. Um, I can say that I like being tracked by Yasik or that I am trackable by Yasik. So he has that thing on the phone, it's an app, he can see where I am. And mostly this is because I'm a paranoid person. Like in my head, although I'm not, in my head I'm an heiress. I can be kidnapped at any time. And I, like that is, I, I have, I'm worried about my safety. I always like him knowing where I am so he can find me in case something happens to me. We also have security cameras all outside our property. Most people do, and then there's an app, and it will ping you. Like, if someone's in your yard, it will alert you. Yasik has it on the most sensitive function because he is very territorial right. about our home. And so if I'm in the backyard, he can see when I'm there, and sometimes he'll, like, call me or text me and be like, those shorts look really good on you. I can <laughs> see you on camera. No, no, am I in my bad because marriage? You're consenting to this. Yes. You've yeah. obviously discussed yes, track it. Track me, my husband. Right. Yes. Oh. Track you because we didn't know that tracking could be foreplay. And so <laughs> there's that. Okay. <laughs> so sure. I think um, for me, clearly, I'm along your vibe, Cynthia. I'm like, clearly there's bigger issues in the relationship than, than just tracking me on my phone. Although my husband is notoriously not on social media. But back in the day when Twitter was, you know, de rigueur, all of a sudden, my husband was like, I'm on Twitter now. I'm like, I'm sorry, what, why? <laughs> because in the early days, I was very active and posting where I was, posting pictures and stuff that we were doing, for example. And people would say to him on the street, oh my gosh, like your wife met so-and-so who's famous at the thing? And he's like, what are you even talking about? <laughs> so he didn't like to find out on the street what his wife was doing. Right. So he signed up on Twitter, because inevitably I was tweeting where I was, who I was with, all these things. So that's how he kept up with me, but it was like, I was okay with that because there's nothing secretive about what I'm doing, right? So Consent. there's a difference. Consent. Consent. Well, if the whole yeah. world, if the whole town can know where you are, then husband your husband can know, can know where, where you are. I am. Well, that's the problem is that, so one time on Twitter, I was walking in the mall and someone came up to me and said, how are you feeling? And I was like, uh, fine, what do you mean? They're like, oh, I saw on Twitter you had a cold and I was just worried about how you are. <laughs> and from then on, I was like, I'm not sharing anything anymore. I don't share my location, it just felt too, too knowing, too vulnerable. Yeah. And so for me, it, it probably is different with a partner. Yeah. But I'm the type where if I'm on vacation, you won't even know from my vacation pics. I post them after I'm back That's what landed. I do. Smart yeah. idea. Yeah. 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 You should yeah. definitely post this outfit, though. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> you know where you can get some more all around great content? Our YouTube page. It's filled with all the laughs and thought provoking chats you could ask for. So do yourself a favor like and subscribe now.